Hi children, my name is Mansi and I'm going to help you with the following question. The question says, prove the following by using the principle of mathematical induction for all n belonging to natural numbers. 1 upon 1 into 2 into 3 plus 1 upon 2 into 3 into 4 plus 1 upon 3 into 4 into 5 up till 1 upon n into n plus 1 into n plus 2 is equal to n into n plus 3 divided by 4 into n plus 1 into n plus 2. In this question, we need to prove by using the principle of mathematical induction. Now, before doing the question, we see the key idea behind the question. We know that the principle of mathematical induction is a specific technique which is used to prove certain statements that are formulated in terms of n, where n is a positive integer. The principle can be explained with the help of two properties. If there is a given statement P at N such that first P at 1 is true and second if statement is true for N equal to K where k is some positive integer p at k is true then statement p at k plus 1 is also true for n equal to k plus 1. Then p at n is true for all natural numbers n. Using these two properties, we will show that statement is true for n equal to 1, then assume it is true for n equal to k, and then we prove that it is also true for n equal to k plus 1, hence proving that it is true for all n belonging to natural numbers. Now, we start with the solution to this question. In this question, we have to prove that 1 upon 1 into 2 into 3 plus 1 upon 2 into 3 into 4 plus 1 upon 3 into 4 into 5 and so on till 1 upon n into n plus 1 into n plus 2 is equal to n into n plus 3 divided by n plus 1 into n plus 2 and this whole multiplied by 4. Now, let P at N be 1 upon 1 into 2 into 3 plus 1 upon 2 into 3 into 4 plus 1 upon 3 into 4 into 5 and so on till 1 upon N into N plus 1 into N plus 2 is equal to n into n plus 3 divided by 4 into n plus 1 into n plus 2. Now, putting n equal to 1, p at 1 becomes 1 upon 1 into 2 into 3 is equal to 1 upon 1 multiplied by 1 plus 1 multiplied by 1 plus 2 and this is equal to 1 upon 6 and this is true. Now, assuming that 
P at K is true. P at K becomes 1 upon 1 into 2 into 3 plus 1 upon 2 into 3 into 4 plus 1 upon 3 into 4 into 5 and so on till 1 upon k into k plus 1 into k plus 2 is equal to k into k plus 3 divided by 4 into k plus 1 into k plus 2. Let this be the equation 1. Now, we have to prove that P at K plus 1 is also true. P at K plus 1 is 1 upon 1 into 2 into 3 plus 1 upon 2 into 3 into 4 plus 1 upon 3 into 4 into 5 and so on till 1 upon k into k plus 1 into k plus 2 plus 1 upon k plus 1 into k plus 2 into k plus 3. Now we see that this is equal to k into k plus 3 divided by 4 into k plus 1 into k plus 2 plus 1 upon k plus 1 into k plus 2 into k plus 3 and this we get using first. Now adding the two expressions We get k into k plus 3 into k plus 3 plus 4 divided by 4 into k plus 1 into k plus 2 into k plus 3. This is same as k cube plus 6k square plus 9k plus 4 divided by 4 into k plus 1 into k plus 2 into k plus 3. Now as k cube plus 6k square plus 9k plus 4 can be written as k cube plus 2k square plus 4k square plus k plus 8k plus 4. This becomes equal to k cube plus 2k square plus 4k square plus k plus 8k plus 4. This entire term divided by 4 into k plus 1 into k plus 2 into k plus 3. Now, taking k square plus 2k plus 1 as common we get k into k square plus 2k plus 1 plus 4 into k square plus 2k plus 1 this entire term divided by 4 into k plus 1 into k plus 2 into k plus 3 This is equal to k plus 4 into k square plus 2k plus 1 divided by 4 into k plus 1 into k plus 2 into k plus 3. Now, as k plus 1 into k plus 1 
is equal to k square plus 2k plus 1. So, we get this to be equal to k plus 4 into k plus 1 into k plus 1 divided by 4 into k plus 1 into k plus 2 into k plus 3. Now, cancelling k plus 1, we get k plus 1 into k plus 4 divided by 4 into k plus 2 into k plus 3. Representing the expression in terms of k plus 1 we get k plus 1 into k plus 1 plus 3 divided by 4 into k plus 1 plus 1 into k plus 1 plus 2 which is same as p at k plus 1. Thus, P at K plus 1 is true wherever P at K is true. Hence, from the principle of mathematical induction the statement P at N is true for all natural numbers N. Hence proved. I hope you understood the question and enjoyed the session. Goodbye.